Hi, I am Valder Beebe. I am the host and the visionary of that celebrity interview. Carlos Watson, good morning. I hope you're well and healthy, and I'm so excited you're here on the Valder Beebe Show as I talk to people across America. How are you? I'm doing really well, and uh, thank you for having me. Well, I feel honored. Before I get into my conversation, i got to tell my audience that you've got a resume that reads like who's who in journalists. I know that you have something going with the A&E Networks in January. You've got a project with them. You've got something with Lifetime Television. You've got the contenders coming to the History Channel. You've got Ozzy Media, and your black women own the conversation motherhood on own network. Just got nominated for an Emmy. Now, I could go on and on. I just want to say congratulations, and I know my audience supports me in that. Uh, Valder, you were super kind, and I really appreciate you saying that. And and it has been a pleasure um, uh, trying to create interesting content, whether that's been TV shows or podcasts or you know, our daily digital magazine. I love the idea of doing things that make people think, um, that maybe take them outside their world for a moment. Um, and, and, you know, as I used to say on uh, Fat Albert, you know, if you're not careful, you just might learn something. Well, you've got What's Next in America. Tell me a little bit about that before I have to let you go. Uh, you know, one of the things that we're doing with the Carlos Watson show every day on YouTube is bringing literally a different, fresh voice to the table. And so whether it's been someone like Congresswoman Karen Bass, who could become uh, Biden's uh, uh, vice presidential selection, or whether it's been an entrepreneur like Bethany Frankel or an author like Malcolm Gladwell, we, we wanted to bring people whose stories might surprise you, especially their backstories, but who also may have really thoughtful things to say on all that's happening here in the moment. And whether that's Black Lives Matter and the social justice awakening that's happening, whether that's uh, looking at what's going on with the economy or even trying to think about what does a post-pandemic world look like? You know, we've wanted to bring those fresh voices to the table. Well, you've also had Terry Crews and I think very interesting Sean Spicer. <laughs> you had some really good guests. Uh, we've been fortunate. It's been uh, it's been a live wire, and there's only more good people uh, on the way. Uh, you know, NFL superstar uh, Baker Mayfield uh, uh, is coming, uh, uh, comedian George Lopez, and just lots of other good people. So really excited about the growth of the show. Did you? No one saw the pandemic coming, but your company seems to be positioned to do exactly what a lot of other companies, and I'm talking about like major studios, can't do. Was this a part of my, your five-year business plan? Let me do digital. I know I'll be out there. This will work. Or are you just blessed by God? Uh, well, I, I certainly uh, have been blessed and, uh, and, and am grateful uh, every day uh, for that. Um, uh, I, our hope was always to offer a, bride, a broad variety of programming. And I think when the pandemic happened, you know, uh, the kinds of things that, that my mother and father always used to say, turn uh, lemons into lemonade, was, uh, was part of what we embraced. And so we have been more creative and more active, creating more original television programming, more original podcasts, uh, more newsletters and, and feature written pieces. So it's, uh, it's been a busy time, a creative time. You seem to be extremely creative, so creative that you've captured the attention of own network or Miss Oprah Winfrey. How does that work for you? Uh, you know, uh, Oprah has, has long been one of my heroes. I've admired not only the way, Valder, that she would entertain people, but I thought the way that she would change their thinking. I mean, she got people to read who weren't reading. Um, she had people thinking about different ways to raise kids, different ways to, to treat loved ones, different ways to deal with trauma even got people to think differently about what at the time was a relatively skinny, unknown guy from Illinois who uh, wanted to make a long shot bid for president. So I have such enormous respect for her ability uh, uh, not only to entertain us, but, but really to, to, to challenge us to be our best selves. You are doing diverse media, and as I wrap up, you have not asked for a seat at the table, it seems, and you've created the table. You're at the table with Tyler Perry and Oprah Winfrey. Is this your time? Uh, Valor, you were, you were so kind to say that. Um, I, I hope it's a time for a lot of people. I hope it's a time for a better 
for a better America and a better world. I think there is so much talent that doesn't always get a chance to participate and contribute. Uh, and our world needs uh, broader inclusivity. I mean, it's not only, and I'm telling you what I know you believe, it's not only the moral thing to do, but it's also the better thing. You know what I mean? It's the, it's the better thing to allow more people to bring their talents to the table and to be part of storytelling and part of uh, guiding and growing. And so if, if I can be a part of that and the other folks here at Ozzy can be part of, of broadening uh, the circle, I'm, I'm really proud of that and, and really appreciative that, that we're getting that opportunity. Well, I thank you for the opportunity to enlighten my audience and to embrace them today, Carlos. What's next in America? When do you want us to watch it and where? Um, I, they should tune in to youtube.com backslash Ozzy, that's O-Z-Y, and they can watch the Carlos Watson Show every day. And better yet, if they hit the subscribe button, uh, it'll come their way on its own. And then we also have a delicious podcast, uh, Valder, as well. If they go to the iHeart uh, podcast app or to Apple or Spotify or wherever they get their podcast, they can uh, they can come get some of the good stuff. The man of all media. We love you, Carlos Watson. Because you are part of W. E. Du Bois' talent intent, and I know you know that. Thank you for being uh, my guest 100%. on the Valder BB Show. Valder, thank you. Be well. My phone pouch. My phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, pocket-free, purse-free, even belt-free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com. Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, host of the Valder Beebe Show. I have used Credit Help USA, the credit restoration company that's bonded and state certified. When you become a client of Credit Help USA, you become eligible for a set of stainless steel cookware from Credit Help USA and the Valder Beebe Show. Get your credit straight today. Visit credithelptx.com, click on the Valder Beebe Show icon, and get started living life divinely.